Hi, hello, good morning everyone. Right now, I'm in the car. It is officially moving day. We are starting my moving vlog. We're moving today. <laughs> I haven't like filmed a video in like two, maybe even three weeks, so I kind of like forgot how to do this. So yeah, this is the start of the moving vlog. Yay! Uh, basically, yeah, we're moving. And I decided I love home videos. Like, I love, 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 like, moving, renovating, decorating, shopping, like, all of that. So as soon as I knew we were moving, I was like, okay, I have to do so many room videos. Obviously, there will be, like, full, like, room tours. And my mom's going to do more, like, house stuff. I'm so excited. I have a filming room. Uh, there's going to be gardening vlogs. It's gonna be exciting I'm planning on making this like a whole series thing so this is probably gonna be like vlog one of like moving in etc etc I'm about to drive to the house right now so I'll probably give you guys like an empty room tour and everything because we're doing like our final walkthrough Lola I don't even know if you can see Lola's in the back of my car Lola come look at my vlog Lola look at the vlog <gasps> there she is hi <laughs> Okay, I literally just got here. It's gonna be really echoey because we're in the house now. Basically, I'm gonna give you like an empty tour. So I technically have two rooms in the house. I have a filming room and a bedroom, just like I did in the last place. Like I had like a room that I could like make sets in and stuff. So this is actually like literally the front door. It's like right off the front door, but this is what's gonna be like my filming room slash like office area because I'm gonna buy like a desk as I'm talking I'm gonna put pictures of like everything that I'm like explaining I'm obsessed with these built-ins this is like what made me want to make this my filming room because I'm gonna decorate these so pretty and then I have this huge wall to get creative I think what I'm gonna do is like put a really pretty desk here I already know which one I want I'm gonna change these lights though and I'm gonna put like really pretty ones I might even give you guys I'm not gonna do like a full can you see me up here no I'm too short so I think my mom is gonna do like a full house tour like obviously not instantly because we're gonna be like decorating so for my room we also have double doors sorry if you can hear my parents in the background I'll close that so this I'm gonna give you guys like a huge overview of the room you probably can't tell because I have my exposure kind of high but the bedroom is light blue so I do have to paint it I'm taking down the fan and we're gonna do a really pretty chandelier I actually already ordered it it's coming tomorrow so let me show you the closet by the way one of the best parts I have finally an actual closet now so basically the thing for my closet obviously I hate the lighting in here like the lighting is not good at all We were talking about putting in like a skylight here because there's one in my bathroom I'm just going to like reorganize it if that makes sense again I'll input pictures here, but I'm gonna do like custom Doors because I don't like everything to be open. I feel like it looks messy when everything's just like wide open so I'm gonna do custom doors on all of this and then let me show you, hold on. And then this door we're gonna take off and I'm gonna put in one of the clear glass white French doors. Let me show you the bathroom. It is so bright in here, like the lighting is so good. This is why I love this bathroom. So we have a huge gorgeous skylight. So I get this like a gorgeous view of the sky as I'm taking bubble baths. Like, oh my gosh, I don't know. This is just like insane to me that I have my own bathroom, like this is so cool. I know it probably seemed like I had one in the old house, like I technically did because I don't have any siblings, but like my bathroom was never attached to my room. You know, it was like the upstairs general bathroom. It was just like my room was next to it. Well, my room was the attic, but like, yeah, so I didn't have my own bathroom, the pretty marble one that you guys always saw me filming everything in, that was actually my parents' bathroom. It's just, it's so nice, I'm so excited. And to like even just have a room this nice with like a walk-in closet, like, oh my gosh, I just feel like so thankful right now. Like this is so awesome. I can finally fit all my clothes in my closet. Let me start from the beginning. So here's the bathtub. It has this jacuzzi tub in it. I'm gonna put, I can't decide if I want to do either a pedestal tub or a clawfoot tub. So I'm still deciding on that. I can't tell which one I want yet, but we're definitely taking this out and we're redoing the tiling. I'm not sure again, like 100% which tile I want, but I'm thinking I'm gonna do something marble and I was gonna kind of do like marble herringbone. Um, 
the shower is staying I love that it has like the gold accents on it it's just like this glass shower and then obviously the tile needs to match the floor so we're just gonna like run the same marble all the way up obviously we have to we're taking all of this out so this will all be like open I can put like a little organizer here for like all my products for the sink the sink I'm changing I already know which one I want to get online I'm obviously changing those lights up there because they're super old and then yeah and then you can just walk right back into my room and I'm so excited about the kitchen as well because you guys know I love cooking and like <gasps> cooking with Kelsey's I just like I'm just like randomly walking around the house we have this cute little seat here I'm probably gonna put like flowers and stuff maybe make it like a little like bench and by the way this is our living room there's more like built-ins here we've got a sunroom here my camera's totally dying but this is our deck but yeah so the movers just got to the house so they're finally here we have like a whole crew so we don't actually have to unpack anything ourselves the only thing i have to bring in is just all the crap that i have in my car okay so i just came back from running some errands and this isn't even all my boxes this is like just some of my clothing but yeah so it's like six o'clock right now they're still unloading like the truck i'm not sure how much i'm gonna get done today like i don't even know if i'm gonna start unpacking today like i may just like get dinner and relax tonight and then like start unpacking tomorrow good morning day two so like i said yesterday i think i ended on the note that i wasn't gonna unpack anything i was just gonna like relax and go to bed which is exactly what i did so i have my tea so i've gotten ready um i washed my hair so i just did like a little like wet sleek ballerina bun i'm still kind of like in my pajamas so we're gonna shop for like a bunch of things and i'm not gonna obviously be able to get everything that i want today plus there's like so many different home stores i want to go to i'm not even going to be able to get to them all today but we're not leaving till like three o'clock and it's like 10 in the morning so until then i'm gonna start unpacking stuff let's <coughs> Oh my gosh, let's start. So there are about like 30 boxes that say this and this. So I'm now discovering a lot of these boxes aren't even mine. The Basically what my mom told the movers is any boxes that don't have labels are most likely mine. I don't know why she said that because I labeled all my boxes. So there's a ton of stuff that's like not even mine in here. I was so worried literally all of this was just my clothes, but it is not. Like this box, it's literally just nerd cave stuff. It's like lightsabers, pop figures, um, anime stuff, adventure time stuff, Wayne's World, um, Thor's hammer, lightsabers, that kind of thing. Those are definitely not going in my room. It doesn't really match the aesthetic. So we have like a whole section in my basement where we're gonna do my nerd cave. Basically, so I've been opening all the boxes. I don't even like, <sighs> this footage is like all over the place. I'm just like talking so much. I don't even know like what I've explained to you guys and if any of it makes sense. So obviously I think the first thing I'm gonna have to do is start putting my clothes away. See, I really wanted like a nice Carrie Bradshaw moment and I was gonna put like a pair of my Manolos. We're gonna be like the first thing, you know, to go in my closet, like right in the center, right there. And now I can't do that because I don't know where my shoe boxes are. I think they're down at the bottom. I mean, I have no idea where they are. Um, I just, I really wanted that pivotal moment of like a pair of my Manolo Blahnik heels being like the first and only thing in my closet. When God said, <laughs> he will provide, he does. Let me tell you, guess what was under it? My shoe box. Guess what was right on top? A pair of Manolos. I can live my dream now. Thank you, Jesus. This is great. I've got my gold ones here. I bet most people watching my vlogs are like, what is wrong with her? Okay. Okay, it doesn't look that great, but it looks great to me. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to give you guys a little update. This right here is all of my blouses. So this is like button-up shirts. Anything sort of long sleeve blousey, long sleeve bodysuits, that sort of thing. This here is all of my tank tops and tube tops. So anything strapless or any just sort of tank top or tank topped bodysuit. Okay, so I'm about to get dressed now, but I wanted to show you guys the like 
So far what I've done, I've unpacked about six or seven boxes and I've changed around the closet format quite a bit. So, so far what I have going on here, I have t-shirts hanging up here and tank tops and bodysuits down there. And then this is going to be all my blouses, which is crazy because this is a lot of blouses. But I've started folding sweaters here. These are mainly just like button-up sweaters down here. And then so far I just have like white, black and white sweaters up there. I have more sweaters in here. What I'm putting in here, I want to keep it more minimal because I started packing a lot in here and it looked really messy. So I'm just going to keep them sort of like very minimal, but these are just going to be like my top favorite go-to sweaters. I decided to take out the shoes from here, which is why they're there, but I'm not putting shoes there. Um, but my mom thought bags would look a lot better here, so I did that, and they do. They definitely look so much better here. Over here is all of my dresses so far. Again, color-coordinated to like my white dresses, my like lace dresses, nude dresses, gray dresses, black and white dresses, brownish dresses, black dresses. Over here is all of my pants, so these are jeans at the bottom so anything denim and then all my just like fabric whether they're like leather lace dress pants all my pants go up here here so far what I have going on is shorts are here and then this is also shorts but like different these are like fabric shorts and then these are denim skirts no clue what I'm doing with these three yet but right here I've started putting jackets here I decided I think I'm just doing pajama clothes so I just kind of have like my pajama t-shirts these are gonna be like sweatshirts and little sweaters I think this is sweatpants is gonna be in here I'm gonna put like legging workout clothes down there so this is gonna be like my comfortable clothing section and then I think for this I may get even more baskets and do like you know socks bras underwear bathing suits something like that um but i definitely want to get really cute baskets while we're at this stoplight <laughs> we're in the car now we're gonna go shopping we have lots of things to Woo! get okay <laughs> so we're at this amazing store that we recently found. they just opened this new furniture store like perfect timing like right as we move and it's like the best furniture store we've ever been to so we haven't shopped here we were like waiting to move uh, in i'm exploding we just walked into the front door and my there's eyes so much <laughs> like, like there's so like i'm going to need multiple cars <laughs> she has a car and i have a car I we, need we a both have bed. cars <laughs> i know we need like a whole u-haul okay so i just found this table it's literally on sale for 65 dollars it's so pretty so it's got like this gold and then it's like marble on top the wall on the right when you walk into my room i wanted to do like a reading nook where i want to do like two accent chairs and, like a little table with like magazines like a whole little like reading area and i think that this would be so perfect and it's on sale for 65 dollars so i really like it i got a ticket so they can hold my stuff up front but i just I just got this. It's also on clearance. I don't know why there's all the good stuff's in the clearance section. It's 39 bucks. It's this little poof. It's got the same matching legs. Like they match exact as the table that I just picked up. Thinking of putting this in my closet, like on the floor. Okay, so I just found this, which is so pretty. It's this little French trash can. I need a trash can for my bathroom. So this is perfect. The only thing is I'm so pissed. They had like a whole matching set of the French stuff where it was like the soaps, the little like napkin holder, and it was all it all matched and they sold all, out of all of it like the last time I was here I saw it now they only have the trash can and like the cotton ball holder but I don't ever use cotton balls so I'm just gonna get that okay put you okay you're not tall enough get I got a bowl so I know strange transition I only think I vlogged in one store because I only ended up buying from one store we went to a few others but I didn't get anything so I figured like why bother even vlogging if I didn't end up buying anything we went to two home goods which I'm so disappointed because I've never been to a home goods and like not wanted something and they were just like so pick through and terrible so we're gonna do more shopping today so there might be more shopping in this vlog I mean I don't even know where I'm gonna end it but I'm gonna show you what I did get from home since I got like one thing from home goods which is these so I'm just gonna give you like a little haul of what I got so I got these like really cool I honestly don't even know what they're technically called I think these would honestly be really cool is like taking all my really big like fashion books and using them like bookends would be cool or even I'm gonna put a fireplace like on in my room and having these on top of the fireplace would be cool I really like them I like that they were like distressed they look like they kind of came from like some sort of like French chateau museum-y vibe i have really cool like garden plants so i got these two 
this is like the mini one i bought this oh my gosh i just noticed how much these look alike i bought this little like planter this was on sale for 29 dollars. almost everything i got was on clearance which is so insane like oh, literally almost everything i got was from the clearance section i don't know how but their clearance section was popping okay um uh, and then i got this one which is really heavy but it's just kind of like matches with this one so i thought this would be really cool it has like little holes here so you can screw it like into the wall or like on a tree or something and then have like you know vines just sort of draping out of it or put some sort of like plant and then viney drippage you guys saw this i got this little gold like toilet paper holder um i just bought some like more little like books and stuff this was also on sale $11. So that's everything I got. Obviously, I didn't get nearly as much stuff as I planned to get. So we're going back out shopping today. I really wanted to get like bins, like I said, to organize in my walk in closet. So I'm going to go to the container store. I did some like online shopping because I went to Target to get them and they were all so ugly. They had like the ugliest patterns of like weird floral and like. I didn't like them. So I found cute ones at container store. We're gonna go to the container store and get those. We set up this morning, well my dad did. He set up my headboard. We have to get a box spring because my mattress is too short to fit. So we're gonna order one just overnight it on Amazon. But we did set up the headboard. It looks really cute. It's just this like off-white tuft winged linen headboard. Love it. And then also my chandelier came in the mail. I have this little like thingy. I'll show it to you guys, but I have to spray paint it white today. So I got it at this really cool place. Place. I'm not sure what it is. We actually might go back there today, but it's just basically like used furniture and like home stuff So they even have like stuff that's good for like if you do DIY projects because they have like just excess like all this cool stuff So much cool stuff and I got it there for like ten dollars It's just like the ornate little scrolly thing that goes around your chandelier. I don't know what it's called But I need to spray paint that white today. So I'm gonna do that And so far that's the plans for today. This is the thing that I'm gonna spray paint white This is what goes like around my chandelier Okay, so this is what it looks like. I just spray painted it white because it was like a really weird like off-white yellowish eggshell color. So this is gonna look so pretty with my chandelier. <laughs> we are ready. We are about to go. Shopping again. Shopping again. Now we're gonna go to the container store, which we were yeah. right next to it yesterday. I don't know why we didn't end up going. But I found some boxes that I want for my closet online. She's gonna look at like the closet organization systems. We're just gonna like look for organizing, <laughs> organizing, <laughs> organizing <laughs> things. Okay, here we are, container store. Looking for cute white baskets. I saw specific ones online that I wanted and that is what I'm looking for and I'm set on Those like aren't that bad, but that's not what I'm looking for. I'm trying to find them. So I found the bins that I'm looking for they are Those ones all the way up there, but they only have two of them and I literally need like probably eight of them Oh, here they are. Oh <laughs> Here they are, these are it. These are the ones that I'm getting. They just have this little like gold thing so I can put like what I have in there. And then they're closed so I can put like socks in one, underwear, bras, bikinis, and one pieces, and all that sort of stuff. <laughs> okay, so I got my boxes, yay! That was like yay. the only anxiety I had was I was like, I need to get these boxes. Sadly, they only had four in the store, but they ordered more for me online. They're going to ship straight to the house. She said they ship pretty quick, too. So I'm home now. These are what the boxes look like. They look so good. I love them. I bought these little um, gold and white labels to put in here so I can know what's in them. I also had hit up the vintage store, and I got some Dean Martin records for my room because my dad actually has a record player I'm probably going to steal, and I really love Dean Martin. I also wanted to show this little update. I finally figured out, I mean, at least for the most part this part of how I'm doing my sweaters so I have some of these folded here because those looked really pretty but the rest of them I actually rolled them I don't know how I came up with this I don't know if this is a thing people do but I just like randomly did one and I was like hey that kind of looks cute okay and so I feel like this vlog has been like really focused on my closet the most but that was like the most essential like important thing to me was I wanted to just start moving into my closet this part that is not staying like that don't let's turn the angle don't look at that 
so I guess that's gonna be the end of this vlog and then I'll probably well I'm gonna like continue to vlog every single day every time I update something buy a new piece of furniture get something done when I start painting like every update I'm going to vlog and just like continue to compile them so I don't know how this is gonna work and then I'm just gonna edit it all into one and then every time it uploads that's I guess we're all cut it off so this was probably like the least productive vlog of them all but I did actually get a lot done I'm like already almost completely finished my closet which I did not expect to get done within like the first two days of moving in so that is going to be the end of this vlog but make sure to subscribe to stay tuned for this whole ordeal that I'm doing on my room so make sure to follow me on Instagram also for mini updates when I'm not like posting anything on my vlog like I'll probably just be doing like updates throughout my Instagram story if you guys want to see like more in detail stuff and maybe even more details of like where I get things all of that all the like little knickknacky stuff that I buy and I decorate and I organize with that doesn't go in the vlog will most likely go on my Instagram stories so make sure to follow me on Instagram I love you guys so so much and I will see you in my next video Mwah.